Monkey and Elephant and the Babysitting Adventure by Carl Lexa Schaefer, illustrated by Galia Bernstein. Contents: Chapter One, A Prize. Chapter Two, Some Rules. Chapter Three, Home Again. Chapter One, A Prize. One afternoon, Elephant said. It sure is quiet around here today. Monkey wiggled her ears. Maybe too quiet, she said. Just then, Cousin Mimi and her baby stopped by. Good news, said Mimi. My mashed banana pie won first prize in the Yum Yum Baking Contest. Ooh, that is good news, said Monkey, clapping her hands. What's the prize? asked Elephant. A cart full of coconuts, said Mimi. Nice, said Monkey. Yes, said Mimi. But I must pick them up at Tasty Cooking School. Too far to take my babies. Not too far for me, said Baby One. Not far for me, said Baby Two. Not me, Tihi, said Baby Three. If only I had a babysitter, said Cousin Mimi. Monkey looked at Elephant. It's really too quiet around here, she said. We will babysit for you, Mimi. We will, said Elephant. Of course we will, said Monkey. Right, Elephant? She gave him a little poke. Hmm, said Elephant. Of course. Oh, thank you, Monkey and Elephant, said Cousin Mimi. I'll bring the babies over tomorrow after breakfast. Mmm, I like breakfast," said Baby One. Mmm, and lunch," said Baby Two. Mmm, and snacks. Tee hee," said Baby Three. Mimi and the babies waved bye bye and headed for home. Mmm, Monkey," said Elephant. "Have you ever babysat before?" Monkey shrugged. No, not really. Have you? No, never," said Elephant. "Well then, best friend," said Monkey. "Here we go again, together on another adventure." Chapter two: Some rules. Monkey said, "Elephant, the next morning, do you think babysitting will be hard?" Monkey scampered up his trunk and settled behind one big ear. For babysitting, she said, "We need some rules." What rules? Asked Elephant. Monkey scratched her head and looked down the path. I will tell you when I know, she said, scrambling down Elephant's trunk. They're here. We want to play, shouted Baby One. Play with you, shouted Baby Two. Play with me. Tee hee, shouted Baby Three. Mimi blew kisses and hurried away. The babies ran around Elephant. They grabbed his tail, squeezed his ears, and jumped rope with his trunk. Ouch! cried Elephant. Rule number one, said Monkey. Play, but not too rough. Okay? Okay. They all agreed. I want to race now, hollered Baby One. Race fast! shouted Baby Two. Race me! Tee hee! Squealed Baby Three. No, me, me, me! They all shouted. Quiet, please, said Monkey. Rule number two: No, me, me, me. She drew a line in the dust. Everyone starts here at the same time, okay? Okay, the babies agreed. Now listen for elephant's trumpets, said Monkey. Wah, wah, wah! Elephant blew. Go. The babies raced back and forth, back and forth until too hard," said Baby One. "Give me water," said Baby Two. "I hungry," said Baby Three without a tee hee. "Uh oh," said Elephant. "Are they whining?" "I think so," said Monkey. "Is there a rule for it?" Monkey held up three fingers. Rule number three: snack now, nap later. Elephant set down cups of water. 
Monkey gave the baby some banana chips. They nibbled and yawned, nibbled and yawned. And when you finish eating, said Monkey, it's snack time. But by then they were already snuggled up asleep. Ahua! Elephant yawned. Baby sitting sure is hard work. Monkey closed her eyes. Yes, it sure is. Chapter three. Home again. Rustle, rustle, rustle. In the tall, dry grass, three riffraff wildcats crouched low and whispered, "Do you know that monkeys are a very good snack?" Do you know that baby monkeys are the very best snack? Oh, oh, oh! I see three of them right now. Elephant sniffed. I smell riff raff wild cats. He said. Monkey opened her eyes. Me too, she said. What'll we do? Make rule number four, he told her. Always keep baby safe. Look, hissed one riff raff wild cat. Now there are four monkey snacks, and one big elephant! Yelled another. Yanks! They screeched, running away fast. And stay away! Snorted elephant. The babies woke up. They rubbed their eyes and looked around. I see elephant right by me, said baby one. I see monkey, said baby two. I see mummy, tee hee hee. Squealed baby three. Hello, 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 said cousin Mimi. What did you do while I was gone? Play not too rough, said baby one. And no me me me, said baby two. And snack then nap. Tee hee, said baby three. Sounds nice and busy, said Mimi. Where's your prize? asked elephant. Cousin Mimi pulled a cartful of coconuts out of the tall grass. Here. She said, "She put a big pile of coconuts in the grass for you, good babysitters." She said, "Thanks," said Monkey and Elephant. Ooh! Yelled Baby One, running toward the cart. Room for babies to ride. Me first. No me," said Baby Two. "Me me." Tee hee," said Baby Three. "Um," <clears throat> said Elephant. Uh oh! Rule number two," said Baby One. "No me, me, me," said Baby Two. "Sorry," tee hee," said Baby Three. They helped one another into the cart. "Me, me," said Elephant. "Even though you have a cart now, sometimes can we still babysit so things won't get too quiet?" said Monkey. "What do you say, babies?" asked Me, me. "Sometimes, for sure." Wait. They agreed and waved bye bye. Monkey and elephant sat in the shade, sipping fresh coconut juice. Ah, sighed Monkey. A nice way to end this adventure. Mmm, adventure, said elephant. What we both like, said Monkey. Right, friend? Just right, said elephant. For our very own rule. Monkey and elephant will stay adventure friends and best friends," added Monkey. "Forever," Monkey and elephant promised together. Bonk.